Hi everyone, my name is Britton Klein, Ad Sales Manager, and with I'm me, William Klein, Publisher, and welcome to Fantasy, Fantasy Lake, Cary, North Carolina. So crazy, right? so happy to be here. Very We're at a quarry. What are we doing today That's here, right. Britton? We have been blessed by our good friends at Garmin. Come check out Fantasy Lake and um, give their new tech a test drive. So That's right. Really the, excited. The Descent S1 buoy. It's That's an underwater right. communications device for Garmin computers, mm -hmm. and we saw a cool demo last night. Super and epic. we're going to. We cannot wait. We're gonna get in the water thing. here, and the in water actually the water. looks pretty good, actually, nice and clear. We got divers over here going down. We're gonna be diving down underneath those buoys under the like airplane down there in a That's bus. Right, and, and I think they said a forklift, or maybe it was an excavator, a rock crusher, or something. Very but yeah, we're gonna have the computers on, cool. test it, and we'll let you know all how it goes. That's right. All right, stay, stay tuned. tuned. here today. Brandon. Today our special guest is Stephen DeMoss. Stephen hey DeMoss. Britton and William, great to see you guys again. It seems like we're doing this every week. We just I saw know. you uh, like not long ago on the, on the podcast. It was awesome and then we saw you in Long Beach and uh, that was great to talk to industry people and see what's going on, especially you guys from the, the numbers and, and data standpoint. But you know, it's, it's great to be out here uh, You know, this week with the, with the Garmin team and we're, uh, we're testing out the new S1 uh, buoy and getting the dive together, and we're getting to yeah, dive. You know, it's yeah, something it's that we way. don't uh, we don't get to do often enough yeah. as we work in, in in our business in the the safety part. We grind it out in the office every day yeah. and try to make the lives of divers safer and more enjoyable. And it's great to get out here for ourselves and to kind of experience it and, and to meet the fellow industry professionals as well. So cool. so, yeah, it's really great. But uh, great dive today. Can we're 20 feet, 25 feet, right? 25 right? feet. Yeah, yeah like bad, so it should stay nice and warm. No need for a wetsuit or. or or uh, you know, any of that, so it should be really great. And we're also, uh, we also have a plan uh, to go to the EPM headquarters. All right, so you can see we just had a dive team go into the water. So we've got a group, a couple of Garmin folks, and some some of our guests just got into the water, started their dive. So in the S1 experience, you have a few different views. This is kind of the main view of each of the divers. And for each of the divers, what you see here is the diver name is generic, but it could be you know anybody's individual name. You see they're targeting, I think we see a message that just came in. I'll show you that in a minute. Uh, you see their starting tank pressure, their current tank pressure, their current depth. Um, how long they've been in the water. They just started their dive a couple of minutes in. And then you get this running trend line of the last three minutes of depth. So you can kind of see, am I descending? Am I ascending? Kind of hanging out, which is really handy. And you see that for each of the divers that we have in the water. The next view you have, I'll switch over to the floor on the far right, which is our diver view. So this is a really handy view when you've got a team in the water. You see the whole dive group. On the top, you can see everybody's tank pressure, and on this next chart, you see everybody's depth. It's really handy for identifying, okay, who's a little too deep, with too low of, of uh, tank pressure. Um, you get everybody in one view, and then you can drill through and, and uh, drill into an individual diver from this page. You can also see their location. So this is the That's location really cool right view. There, yeah. So we have our buoy out there, uh, hanging out the dive park. If I zoom in, so that middle thing in the middle is our buoy. And then I will drill in, there's me. So there's where we're standing on the beach, where the position of the phone. And then here is our dive group. Is that cool or what, Britt? So I can see, okay, here's one of our divers. That's Garmin 1. That's one of the Garmin folks on the dive today. And I can open this up then. I see their location and I see all those same stats. So I can keep an eye on how far away they are, where they are at, and be able to track them in the middle of the dive. So it's really easy to keep an eye on the group. And as this updates, you kind of see where everybody's hanging out. If you're diving in buddy teams, you can see, okay, are my, my two people that are together are together, or did someone stray off? And then if you needed to get a hold of somebody, we have messages. So you can message either all of the divers or an individual diver. So right now we have this group chat going. And so then when they first dropped in, they headed down, I sent this proceed message. There's our leader saying, follow me. And they're going on to task one, which we have is kind of our first dive from the inside. And we've got a plane down there, there's a boat down there. And then everybody can say okay. And there's a whole list of messages that um, 
I can communicate to the divers from top side and the divers can communicate back up top side, letting us know how to do Thanks for taking time for this. You bet. This is fantastic. Thank you. This is Thank a you. Uh, closer look at what we were taking a look at underneath the water. So, Braden, what do you think of that? It's pretty amazing, huh? Pretty incredible, man. I got to tell you. What an the amazing. The sights, the tech. I mean, it was such a great dive. I, I felt like it was the highest quality. Yeah. That I've taken up until this and to be able to have that little descent buoy out there and underwater communicate in terms of sending messages from the surface back down and then, and then seeing your tank down pressure, down it was just so much it offered. It was really yeah. cool. It had incredible capabilities. Um, and Patrick Danko's, you know, kind enough to put it all on display. Yeah. So it's the ins and outs, the, the, the you know, full scale of it. It's really really. amazing. I mean, it's incredible tech, yeah. But it's really amazing. More than anything, I feel like it, it really enhanced the dive. It really just took it to that next level. Um, you know, and in terms of uh, just diving in general, I mean, I feel like the safety. It's much safer, yeah. Much it's safer. It's totally true. Much, much safer. So that's going to wrap it up from Fantasy Lake here in Cary, North Carolina. This is the on the road version of Marketing Minutes. That's right. And so stay we'll. Tomorrow, we have a really, really cool episode from Divers Alert Network. <laughs>